All right, guys, welcome back to another video. It's your man, Jay Will. So it's time to give you another video on the Galaxy Note 8 Oreo. Now, I got the Galaxy Note 8 Oreo update at the beginning of April, and I'm happy to report that it's fantastic. There's absolutely nothing going wrong with the phone, except for when I first got it, I started to have some battery drain, and it was very frustrating. Uh, I just didn't know what to do. So some people said, oh, Jay, do a factory reset. I would prefer not to do a factory reset first. I would prefer to clear the, clear the uh, partition cache and uh, sometimes that that will help. Uh, that'll help with fixing problems on your phone. Um, now, I'm also happy to report that I didn't I didn't do a factory reset uh, and backup. I didn't even clear the partition cache yet. I just kept using the phone like I normally would. And in my case, it settled down on its own. I I just haven't had any more battery drain issues like I did initially. Now, what I mean by that is, before I got the Oreo update. I, when I was on Nugget, I was getting six hours or so, possibly a little bit more, and going about a day and a half on a full charge. Now, when I got the Oreo update, and this is the same device I've had since launch, when I got the Oreo update, my battery life started to drastically drain within one day. And I said, you know, man, I got to post a video about this, so put the video up. You, a lot of you guys reported, yep, I got battery drain too. But now that I've had it for almost three weeks or so on, on Oreo, it's doing better. I didn't, like I said, I didn't do the factory reset. I didn't clear my partition cache yet. I just kept using the phone. And um, now I'm getting about five hours of screen on time and I'm definitely making it through a full day. Uh, not getting a day and a half or anything like that. It makes it right to about 24 hours or so and it starts to conk out like 23 or so. And uh, that's that's good enough for me. That's that's actually good battery uh, for what it is. Uh, and I'm I'm just happy to be able to have Oreo on this thing at all because a lot of phones from Samsung they they get left behind when it comes to updates. So update, I had to give you an update. Is your battery life getting better on Oreo since the initial install? Did you do a factory reset? Did you clear your partition cache? Did you do any of those things? I did not do those things, and I just kept using my phone, and it got better. I don't know. It settled down. The system leveled out, and I'm good to go now. Now, I would like to see six hours or more of screen on time, but ultimately what I do with my phones now, I don't measure the, the uh, phone by screen on time as much as I used to. I want to see how long the phone can be off the charger without issues, without fail. And so when I need to use my phone, I have battery available. Because the average consumer, I don't think they're measuring their screen on time. They want to know how long the phone can go without being charged. And when, they re when they're ready to use it, they have a phone that's charged enough to use. So it's your man, Jay Will. I will see you guys in the next video. Be sure to leave a comment down below if you're not having battery drain issues anymore, if you had them at all. Did you do a factory reset? What did you do with yours? How long have you had Oreo on your Galaxy Note 8? I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.